here with Mr. Jason Lockenfora of CBS Sports. So I kind of disguised some questions to help us betters out from your point of view as an NFL sure. analyst. We're going to start okay. with the Chiefs. Um, 11 and a half. What do you think about that? Look, I think they had the best offseason of any team in the NFL. They got the best player in the game, someone who might go down eventually. It's the best player in the history of the game, secured for 12 seasons. If you're making me touch the, the Chiefs, I, I would go over. All right, next win total that we're talking about is the Patriots, nine and a half. What do we think about that? More or less or about right? I think Bill Belichick's worth five to six wins, just at a minimum. His operation is going to be worth five to six wins. So to me, Cam was worth another four or five wins on top of what their Stidham win total would have been. So I think this is who they are. I think they're a playoff team. Uh, I think they'll be competitive. Uh, and, and you know, Foxborough in a normal year with fans, I might think maybe even a half win or win more. I don't know how that's going to play out. I think they're a nine or ten win team. Last one I got for you is the Browns at eight and a half. I certainly think they have the talent to win more games than they lose, which would win this bet. And if I had to take this bet, I would go over. Offensive rookie of the year. Burrow's got a great cast around him in Cincinnati. So I, I just think Joe Burrow's gonna look the part. He's gonna, by the end of the season, be a quality NFL starting quarterback. I know there's not a lot of, probably a lot of value in it. He's probably the favorite to win this thing, but I think sometimes chalk is chalk. Who do you think could be the MVP this year? I mean, look, if he stays healthy, Patrick Mahomes, the last time he played a full season through 50 touchdown passes. Is he going to throw 50 again? I don't know. But if he plays 16 games, uh, he's going to throw 40, and maybe 45. I think he's I think he's going to win a lot of hardware throughout his career. And there's probably a little more uh, value in Russell Wilson. So he would be sort of my 1B. If you could choose one head coach to be your college roommate, who would you choose? Being a wingman for Sean McVay or Cliff Kingsbury probably would entail a lot of fun, uh, <laughs> some parties. I'll say I'll say Sean McVay. Probably your best bet of the whole the whole the whole card. Thanks, Megan. Thank you so much, Jason. So I have decided to take a six point teaser, teasing the points down from both the Chiefs and the Patriots. In my mind, there is no way that the Chiefs lose this game. I think that Andy Reid runs his new toy ragged and hilaire. I think Kelsey is going to be a reception monster, obviously all orchestrated by the amazing Patrick Mahomes. We have a similar situation in Foxborough. Bill Belichick is ready to prove to everyone that he can win games without Tom Brady. And I think Cam Newton is on board. I think him and Bill are out here to prove to the world that this Patriots team is capable without Tom Brady. I think that they kind of just roll over this Dolphins team and get the win. All right, y'all, that's all I have for this week. Another huge thank you to CBS football analyst, Mr. Jason Lockenfora. Thank you so much for coming on. My official NFL countdown is over. We have a game tonight, ladies and gentlemen. Let's make some money.